Guten Tag. I hope you guys are feeling blessed and highly flavored. Today's flavor is pumpkin muffin. Yes, I ate a pumpkin muffin this morning. Freaking delicious. Um, probably getting another one tomorrow. So today I'm bringing y'all another plan with me. Um, I did two straight weeks of in my B6 spiral and I absolutely love, love, love my B6 spiral. Can't really put my hand on it right now, but um, yeah, but today I need to um, switch it up just a little bit. I am still using my B6 and I still post it on my Instagram. Which will still be linked in my um, my milkshake link, which will be down in the description. But today I'm doing a plan with me in my recollections classic um, classic size vertical layout. Um, the week I'll be planning for will be from hold on, let me not lie to you. It will be from the 19th to the 20. <laughs> It'll be from October 19th through the 25th. And this is also um, a special video because this is the week of my good friend, um, Queen, birthday. So, um, Queen, if you end up watching this video, I just want to let you know, happy birthday, girl. I hope you get many, many more. And I hope you get everything you want and more out of your birthday week and for the rest of this year and for the next 10 years. And that's that on that. Okay, so... um. Like I said, I'm in my uh, Recollections Coil Bound, and I have it stuck inside my A5 wide uh, A5 wide cover from Print Pression. Excuse me. Um, so uh, I I did an initial setup. I need to reset these pockets up, but um, but yes, I absolutely love 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 this cover. It's a shaker cover. Um, with a whole bunch of iridescence on it and it says shine like the stars. Um, the only thing I had about this cover is that it busts up here and I don't know if it was because I was manhandling it or whatever, but it's just fine. I'm just going to take some hot glue and then make sure to, to seal that up real good. Um, as y'all can probably see, it's spewing tidbits all over my desk. Um, it, it's fine, whatever. Um, anyway. Uh, so yeah, we're going to be planning in this. So let me just go ahead and flip to October. This was me kind of initially setting up, getting back in the, uh, used to, um, using a coil bound of this size. I used to use, uh, another brand of coil bound, but I no longer support that company. So that's that on that. Um, this was another attempt, uh, laid stuff out, didn't use it. I was going to use it for a social media planner and then I turned around and I was like, you know what? No, we're going to end up using this for a catch-all because this planner actually goes into 2021. Yeah, all of 2021. So I'm just going to use it as my big hub. And I don't mind that. It. it just means I'm going to end up with like eight or nine planners uh, for the rest of this year and into next year. So I have no reason to buy any more planners. I might buy covers though. I'm not gonna promise y'all that. Okay, so I'm gonna be using this uh, sticker book from the Honey Bee Shop. This is the Personality Crisis 2.0. I absolutely love, love, love the purples in it. And I like how it has like the, the glam bad girl um, stuff in it. It reminds me a lot of Queen. And I just really love this sticker book. So I'm going to be using this in here. Um, I also pulled out a butt ton of washi. Probably not going to use them all, but I just wanted to have options just in case. Um, Y'all, I feel like I use this set like a million bajillion times. Uh, <laughs> but um, it's just, it, it works with the aesthetic that I have. Um, I also have these... Uh, Ooh, excuse me. These uh baby bats in the same uh these washies are all collab washi between um Cookie Sticker Co and the Honey Bee Shop. Let me move these to the side. Um this is Cookie Sticker Co washi, Michael's washi, um, and print pressions washi that came from the thank you bundle. So um, I might pull a few little stickers here and there out of my reusable sticker book. Um, but I'm, I'm trying to go for like a pastel rainbow, 
a pastel gothy type of deal, you know, because it's Halloween month. But we're going to see how it turns out. But without further ado, sit back, relax, and let's get this thing going.
All right, you guys, here's how the finished bread turned out. Um, I would write in some of the plans, but I don't. My handwriting's not exactly cute. Um, here's a little cute wiggle just so y'all can see how it all came out. I think it actually came out pretty cute. Um, I was struggling because it's been so long since I've planned in a classic size uh, coil bound planner like this, but I think I did pretty good. Um, but I just wanted to hear from y'all too. Comment down below and tell me what are you using now? Have you switched uh, planners since 2020 started? I know I have. And if you did, are you? Uh, have you gotten used to using it or are you still having a little struggle? Uh, are you thinking about changing again? Uh, let me know. If you haven't already, I need you to go ahead and hit that thumbs up and also uh, hit the subscribe button and pop that bell because you know you nosy. If you're of returning thank you so much for tuning in if you're new thank you so much for for dropping through and until next time bye guys